I'm Jackie Williams Bridgers, Managing Director for International Affairs and Trade. The United States faces vital challenges in defeating insurgencies and terrorism in Afghanistan and Pakistan, while responsibly drawing down in Iraq. Since 2001, Congress has provided more than $1 trillion, mostly for efforts to provide stability and counterterrorism in these countries. However, to effectively use these funds, GAO has recommended that U.S. agencies improve their monitoring of programs, oversight of contractors, and accountability for weapons and equipment. U.S. agencies are acting on our recommendations. GAO has also recommended that the administration develop comprehensive integrated plans to guide U.S. efforts in these countries. In 2009, Afghanistan saw the highest number of enemy-initiated attacks since the conflict began. In response, the U.S. is deploying thousands of additional troops to Afghanistan, with a focus on securing the population and training Afghan forces. In Pakistan, the United States has committed $7.5 billion in non-military aid over a five-year period to alleviate economic and social conditions that foster terrorist activity. In Iraq, the U.S. security agreement requires U.S. forces to withdraw by 2011. U.S. civilian agencies will be challenged to assume the responsibilities of the U.S. military, such as training Iraqi police and protecting U.S. personnel. Finally, the United States will have to decide how to respond if security conditions in Iraq deteriorate. Given these challenges, the development of comprehensive plans to integrate the efforts of multiple U.S. agencies and international partners is essential. As mandated by Congress, GAO will help ensure this by reviewing implementation of U.S. plans in all three countries in 2010 and beyond.